Ah, Minecraft. A beautiful world with mountains and the sky. Minecraft also has beautiful buildings and animals, forest, and of course the lovely ocean. But Minecraft wasn't always like this. I started off a little bit weird. Join me on this journey as I will tell you the real story of Minecraft. Ah, the ocean. So beautiful, so colorful, so many fish and mobs. But it wasn't always like this. There was no, there was barely any fish in the ocean. And there was one big fish that ruled the whole ocean 500 million years ago. And its name was the Phantosaurus. It would fly up into the air and dig down again to the ocean. Its favorite food was seagrass. Sometimes the different arts would breed and a new art would come. It's called the Squidosaurus. It's in close family with the squid. It has tentacles, which kind of wasn't good for it. And after many arts started breathing together and together, more arts started showing up. And the ocean started becoming a little bit more colorful with some mobs and some animals. But after many fish started breeding, many different fish arts, the ocean got so much more colorful. There were, there were fish everywhere. And the Squidosaurus, also a lot of there would be sea colorful seagrass at that time. Different types of sharks. And the ocean was a lot more colorful. After a while, the Squidosaurus realized that it was too big. So, different arts started breathing. And the Squidosaurus evolved to be much smaller. And different types of the Squidosaurus and other fish started breeding. And in the end, we got a Sharkosaurus. It's in close family with the shark, but it's much more different. It had the love for the this, this sand and the land and after a while it evolved to to the wolfosaurus it got legs and it kept its white skin but it wasn't skin it, it got fur to protect from the powerful sun the wolfosaurus had no fish, there were no fish on the land, so it had to eat something else. It started its love for the Sheposaurus. It's a close, it's kind of a mountain sheep. It ate so much sheep and so much bones, because it had a love for bones, that it evolved once again. But this time, much taller and much skinnier. It evolved to a skeleton. The skeleton was now much stronger and uh, he could easily kill the sheep now. But there was one big problem. The skeleton could not, it could not, it hated the sun. So it burnt every time the sun came up and it just did not want to feel like this anymore. So, once again, he evolved 
but this time with skin and evolved to the villager as we know today the villager soon started to breed and it learnt how to build how to farm how to make friends and of course how to protect themselves and after a while the villages grew much much bigger but that's just some of the story in the next episode we're going to talk about the caves and more about the villages S of course subscribe and like if you want more and I will see you the next time. Bye.